And welcome to my video review of the Kohler Nightlight Soft Clothes and Fan Scented Toilet Seat. So I requested this product because uh, my wife, you know, she's pregnant and of course has to use the bathroom as every pregnant wife or mother, already mother, knows multiple times a night. So, of course, it's a challenge to be quiet and not wake up your partner or any, or any of the kids, if you have kids in the house near the bathroom, um, when you're doing so. So, this was actually something that would be very helpful for everyone. Uh, installation of the, of the toilet seat is actually pretty simple. On the back, there are some clips that you squeeze together to release the toilet seat. And the clip actually inserts into here. There's a power button here for the night light. When you turn, press the power button, this is the backlit light for when the seat is closed. When the seat is opened, you will see that the bottom light goes on for the bowl. And you might even hear there's also a fan that just kicked on because the uh, sensor has actually detected that I'm squeezing the seat down to simulate a person sitting on the seat. So when you close it, of course, the fan turns off. fan is right here, um, so it's pretty easy to, to hear it. Um, it puts out a, a fairly strong burst of air that's constant as long as you're sitting down the seat. Uh, if you do not want the light to be on, you can simply hold the power button and it'll turn off with the red light there. So we're going to reinstall the seat. And you can see, it went on pretty quickly. Open it up. As you can tell, I did not turn on the light, so there is no light currently in the bowl. And I will even show you, since I cleaned the bowl, no light. However, if I turn the bowl on, the light on, and back, you can now see that there is light. So, um, overall, I really like the the look and function of the seat. Uh, my wife has actually already uh, mentioned that she actually likes the uh, stability of the seat as well. Uh, she likes this one better because it actually has rubberized feet on the bottom. These actually hold a little bit better on the enamel of the seat compared to the plastic uh, bumpers that you typically find on cheaper seats. So we'll see what she thinks overall. Um, going in the long run, but I think it's a good upgrade. Thank you very much for watching.